just got off the phone with the girl who loves you too. Said you're working on yourself, is she helping with that? What's up, guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Julia Morgan. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I own a hair brand called Morgan Hair. Please do well to check it out on Instagram where you can shop very beautiful beads. I'll put the link in the description box below. So today I'll be showing you guys how I treat my wigs and I'll be working with this wig that a customer sent back to me so I could help her revamp it. I'll be showing you guys the products I use as well because it's very easy for you. These are things that you can do from home. As long as you have the right products, you can revamp your wigs yourself. So please watch this video to the end. So this is a closer view of the wig I'm going to be treating today. The frontal is completely destroyed. Honestly, I don't know if she was fighting with the wig or not. She, I think she's used this wig for more than a year and she says she has never treated the wig. She has never washed the hair, so you can imagine. And this, I think this was the 26 inch deep wave wig. You can see that there is still some particles of glue stick to the lace so I will just use my hot comb to remove that. So I just took out the braids, I'm done taking out the braids and this is what the hair looks like and now I'm just going to detangle the hair. You want to detangle it before putting it in water, if not it's going to make the condition of the wig 10 times more that, worse than the way it was. So I'm just sectioning the hair right now in order to detangle it properly. You see this back, this part, you have to detangle it, comb it as many times as possible because it's always so tight. I don't know why. I'm still detangling all. I'm still making sure that I'm detangling the wig properly. Please take your time to detangle the hair before putting it in water. Because if you put it in water like this, it's going to be 10 times worse. You will not be able to detangle it again. You will just have to throw the hair. So please detangle it properly before putting it in water. So you detangle until your comb can pass through without any problem. I'm finally done detangling the hair. I'm just removing the wig from the mannequin head. And this is what it looks like. I'm still using my comb to detangle properly because I want to make sure that there are no tangles inside before I start washing it with the shampoo. I'm filling the heater water because we are going to need hot water. I wet the hair first before applying my shampoo. I 
I use the Tresem Conditional Breakage Shampoo. I apply a generous amount. Please don't be stingy. Put in as much as you need. Then you want to make sure you brush it regularly because you don't want it to tangle while you're trying to wash it with the shampoo. So I use a brush to detangle it while I'm washing it with the shampoo. Now I'm going to rinse this off. Make sure you rinse well. Rinse well. You want to remove whatever shampoo is left on the hair. I mix three different conditioners for the treatment: the Tresem Protect Damage Conditioner, the Clean and Replenish Conditioner, and also the Dye Fuel Conditioner. I apply some keratin hair minus on the hair as well because it helps hydrate and softens the hair as well. Apply a generous amount, so don't be stingy with your products. detangle the hair make sure you brush it many times and ensure that there is no tangling anywhere you want to make sure that you detangle the hair properly for the next step so this is what the hair looks like it's marinated in conditioner i put it in a transparent plastic bag like this you have to make sure it's secured you i lock it then i put it in a bowl and add my hot water it's very hot you're not supposed to put your hair directly in hot water that's why i put it in the back before putting it in hot water then i'm going to leave it in the hot water overnight this is me the next morning taking out the hair now you're going to rinse everything out properly while brushing don't forget you're rinsing and detangling at the same time squeeze 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 and that's it this is what it looks like and now i'm just going to leave it to air dry thank god today is a sunny day so I'll just dry it outside So guys, you can see that the curls are bad. So please take good care of your wigs. Take very good care of your wigs because if you care for your wigs and take very good care of them, it's not going to be difficult for you to treat it and revamp it yourself while you're at home. 
if you don't have anyone who can do it for you take your time to disassemble your hair before putting it in water because if you put it in water like that it's going to be 10 times worse than the way it was so please take very good care of your wigs thank you guys for watching this video i'll be posting more videos on how you can care for and treat your wigs don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your notification bell so that every time i post a video you'll be the first to watch like this video and share it with your friends see you guys in my next video bye i just got off the phone with the girl who loves you too said you're working on yourself is she